Leander Raddick, good win for you today. You saved all the six break points you faced. Do you think the key was that you played better on the big points today? You know, Raddick keeps uh, bringing up one thing that's very important for us, which is the quality of tennis. Um, I find that when um, we focus on the good quality of tennis, then the magic just comes out as a bonus, you know. So for me, I think that's the key. At 5-all in the second set, Leander, you hit a great smash and there was quite a nice celebration there. Can you talk us through that shot? Yes, uh, I said yours, like always, and then he said yours, uh, and then I said yours again, and then I suddenly realized he was stuck, so I basically ran back in real slow motion, and I was very happy that the court's a slow court, so it slowed the ball up, gave me some time, and I got back and actually hit a pretty good smash, and the boys uh, got stuck in no man's land. So we won the point, and uh, we both realized what we had done, so we, that's what make, makes Radic and myself really special. We love our tennis. We love going out there and being there for each other and entertaining the crowd and entertaining ourselves. We have a lot of fun when we play, and that's just our brand of tennis. Radek, when you first joined with Leandro at the start of this season, could you have imagined the success you were going to have this year? Uh, to be honest, I was, uh, you know, it's going to sound like, uh, you know, if I say that I felt like uh, I knew it, that we're going to be su successful. But uh, I had an experience with Leander seven years ago in uh, Dare Beach. We played for the first time together. We played, uh, you know, amazing tennis since the first point until the last point of the tournament. I think we didn't lose the set, right? Yeah. And you know, I felt that we have something which is very unique between uh, each other on the court and also off the court, which makes it even easier than on the court. And uh, you know, in the beginning, I was like, uh, you know, he told me, uh, partner, I just didn't make two things in my career, and it's Australian Open and Masters. So I felt like a huge pressure in the beginning of the Australian Open and we've been able to make it and, you know, let's see what happens this week. And did it take the pressure off your partnership when you qualified for the finals so early on with having won the Australian Open? I don't think there's any pressure on our partnership and that's the fun thing about us. We, uh, Radek's a phenomenal tennis player. He's achieved so much in a singles career. He's achieved so much in, in his doubles career now. He's a Grand Slam champion. Um, he's also achieved so much when he's played for the country of uh, his country, the Czech Republic. Um, for me, he's one of the icons of the game of tennis, and uh, I'm very lucky to have him as a brother. And uh, there's no pressure whatsoever. It's just fun. Radek, how have you improved as a doubles player, playing with someone of Leander's stature this year? You know, his experience and knowing the opponents is just amazing. How they, he knows them, uh, you know, from A to Z, and uh, he can. Uh, he always helped me, you know, because I'm. Uh, Always I'm coming there as a singles player to the court and uh, he's teaching me the way that I have to play uh, doubles and uh, he always gives me something extra which we can use on the on the court and it's, you know, for me it's uh, great fun and uh, to be honest, I don't know with who else I would love to play more than with Lee. Leander, you've qualified for this season finale 14 times. You've played here the past three years. Have you been giving Radek some tips on the atmosphere, uh, how it is to play here? You know, you don't really have to say much to Radek. You just got to keep him happy and uh, let him do his magic. So we get on the court and um, he's come in and acclimatized really quick. Um, he's a hardworking boy. We have magic together, so I really don't have to tell him much. I got to look after my half of the court and make sure I can make one return every now and then to help him out <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and then let him do his stuff, which is great fun.